today. Good, and you? I'm good. Do you happen to have a bag on you? Because I don't have bags. I'm good. Okay. I just saw you riding, so I wanted to make sure. No. Do you have Petra points? Nope, don't have that phone okay. with me. Okay, 11.62. On debit. Have a nice weekend. Thank you, you too. in the bush how are you today um, I'm doing all right definitely got some explainings to do but we'll get to that but anyways we're on an adventure uh, we're here at this bridge we've smoked a joint here on this bridge before but man I haven't had a joint yet today it's like 6 30 it's time to get baked right uh, so we got some Edison it's a combo pack uh, so we have limelight in here. It's a sativa and we have cobra milk. That's an indica uh, So let's try one of these limelights. Let's see how they differ differentiate Differentiate yeah, you know, well, there's no way to know Oh god They're all the same I don't know what this is. Oh, wait a minute. I don't know if you guys can see, but the filter says Indica. We don't want that one quite yet. So let's pop it open and try and find a different one. Aha. And this one says Sativa. Oh, they're so smart. Definitely smarter than me anyways. Ooh. What is that sativa? Limelight. Uh, MK Ultra and East Coast Sour Diesel is what it is mixed with. Mmm, very good. Very good. Wow, I quite enjoy this. But yeah, guys, obviously I've been gone for a while. I, uh, I shut down the membership side of things. Uh, just life and family is important so I had to change a few of my ways and you know just I had to make some changes I haven't made them all yet uh, you know getting there but uh, yeah so it was a it was a rough month of May for me and my wife and my kids but we're doing better so that's good to know Holy shit, beaver. Canadian beaver, your cousin's here. There he is, just chewing on a, chewing on a branch there. Uh, which cousin is this Canadian beaver? Let's see if we can get closer. First wildlife of the trip. I don't know if you caught that bunny as we hit the uh, 
dirt road. That's how I get home to work and home every day. But yeah, he's just chilling in the water. Uh, beautiful day. Uh, right? It's green. There's no ice. Uh, got no gloves. Got no toque. Oh, I shaved, by the way, if you haven't noticed. I did do that. Uh, that feels great, actually. It was starting to get pretty hot and full of concrete. Um, work's been pretty darn busy. We've been working 12, 15 hours just about every day. So that is good. But, uh, it makes camping and other things difficult, but definitely the paycheck is nice. But yeah, guys, we're just about done this joint. Let's hop back on the bike and uh, we'll see if we can find a place to camp for the night. I don't know. I have a general idea. I'm just not 100% sure. So we'll see you when we are ripping again. Hashtag South Camping Alliance. Cush in the bush. Thanks for, uh, thanks for sticking with me, guys. Thanks. <laughs> Okay, well, you seen where I come in. That was kind of where I wanted to park the bike, was in this group of trees, throw some camo over it, and then uh, change locations. Gone. I'm gonna walk out to the road and see what it looks like from there. Okay, well I'm just on the edge of the tree line here. I don't even know where it is. So that side's good. Now uh, this is where we came in. Yeah, she's gone. I'm on the other side of the fence. How I got here, nobody will know, right? Except me. I didn't see any no trespassing signs. Obviously, I'm not, I'm not supposed to be here. That's why we call it stealth camping. And there is the road. And there's a group of trees. Let's check them out. Uh, thanks for joining me so far. Uh, make sure you hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that notifications bell for me, please. And also, on the description of this video, there will be a link to the Stealth Camping Alliance clothing merch store. There we go. That's the word I was looking for. So, yeah. Go check that out. Go support Stealth Camping Alliance and uh, help us grow. So, hashtag self camping alliance. There is another group of trees. But that's where I want to go. Well, I've decided to stick to this tree line a little bit, get behind the gravel piles, and then uh, go in from there. That's a cow poop. Yeah, well, 
that didn't give me any more protection, so I'm just gonna go for it. trees I want to camp in as of right now looks good I uh, decided just to book her so I bucked her uh, the Canadian beaver your cousins have been busy in here. Look at all the beaver damage. All these laying trees are from beavers. Crazy. drive by this group of trees lots and I always just thought you know it'd be neat to freaking camp in here uh, pretty low risk as for people I mean cars driving by might see some light at night but they'll be just looking at the road right uh, the fuzz the fuzz the tree fuzz it's horrible but uh, yeah I gotta figure out a place to hang a hammock well everybody, the sun's about to set. We got uh, maybe a half hour before it kind of gets to where it would set for me. Uh, just after the live, thanks to all who donated. Thank you. Your names will be up on the screen there. Uh, I can't remember them all because, well, we smoke joints, right? Sorry guys. Your names will be up on the screen. But yeah, let's, uh, let's get camp set up uh, before the sun sets. And then at least it is done in the daylight. So, yeah, here we go. Bam! Just like that, camp set up. Well, actually, it was after that beautiful freaking sunrise. Beautiful sunrise. Wow, eh? Crazy. Yeah, beaver action. Look at the sunset we're gonna experience here. <laughs> right by the beaver pond. This is gonna be epic. Well, for this sunset joint, look at this, incredible. Uh, we got green monster breath grown by spinach. Uh, what are we looking at? 26% uh, THC. Let's give one of these guys a try. Well guys, I'm gonna turn around, smoke this joint, drink my last stealth Pepsi, and enjoy this beautiful, beautiful sunset. Fantastic. Weed in a bush, weed in a bush, weed in a bush. Who? Yeah. <laughs> it's weed in a bush. Uh-huh. Paltus name, camping this game. Weed in a bush. Yeah. Weed in a bush. Still. Well, we're just about done this joint. Yeah, we moved locations. Uh, the bugs were bad over there, and we're actually kind of in a hole. The sun is setting, and the moon is rising. Uh, 
we checked today it is like 98.9 percent .9 full so in my books that's a full moon tonight guys but i like it when a weed just tastes like a just a oh and that's what this tastes like uh as for the thc level i can't read i don't know uh again we're after the live stream here a little bit so i'm definitely riding the rip so that'll be it for a little while probably just a bedtime joint but yeah let's sit here finish enjoying the sunset listening to the train toot its horn bit of daylight left so I got some chunky vegetable beef and some buttered cheese bread yeah so let's get this on the go as hungry Perfect, and it's uh, like way easier to like seal back up and bring home. Yeah, sure. Damn, was supper good. Oh man, cheesy bread. Oh, so good. But yeah, we're back here at the uh, sunset. Check out the sky. I hope the camera brings it out as awesome as the eyeballs do. So that there is the full moon. And yeah, the color of the clouds are just pink. But check out the reflection of the pond. But uh, yeah, we will uh, we'll see uh, whatever uh, next adventure we do. It's gonna be a beautiful night. Cushion the bush, hashtag stealth, camping alliance. Stealth Pepsi. Yeah, well we're sitting here on the edge of the beaver pond. Perfectly smooth. No signs of the beavers, haven't heard them for a while. And then we got the full moon behind us. It is fairly late. Figure we smoke a bedtime joint. So our first joint of the day was from that Edison um, Limelight. Uh, we'll try the Cobra Milk because it is an indica and it should just put us right to sleep. The uh, mosquitoes are, they're getting kind of bad and annoying. So, like I said, it's pretty late. But yeah, should be a beautiful night. I got no tarp set up. Not even anything. It's just going to be, but it's not supposed to rain. We had rain a couple days ago. 
definitely needed it. Oh, I'm excited to crawl into the hammock. Oh, it's been so long, so long. Oh. Yeah, guys, let's turn around, watch the cars drive around, stare at the full moon for a little while, smoke this joint. We'll get back to you before we go to bed. Oh, yes, wait a minute. I uh, also made a hot chocolate. I uh, just put it in my coffee mug. Then it just, it just doesn't leak, right? Right? Boom. That's a plane. Well, guys, I'm going to go to bed. Thanks for joining me so far. Next time you see me, should be bright. Nice thing about summer, right? But, uh, I mean, the sun is like, it's still bright where the sunset is, and it's like, 11:15. Definitely excited to go to sleep. So see you in the morning, guys. Smoke weed every day. Cush in the bush. Hashtag Stealth Camping Alliance. Don't forget the freaking merch store. Go check it out. It's Cobra Milk. I quite quite like it. Uh, you can definitely tell it's an indica. Uh, definitely, I'm ready to just chill and lay back and go to sleep. Uh, the taste I can't quite describe. Um, I think we will definitely try to puff on one tomorrow when my taste buds are a little bit cleaner or I'm just less tired. So the taste is very, still very milky, I guess. Like it, it's very creamy. Thick? I'm not sure. Anyways, guys, good night. Good morning. Just shortly after six o'clock, the sun is way up. I got up at about five and I was like, no way. Uh-uh, I am not getting out of this cocoon of awesomeness. So I stayed here, and now it's six. But now let's get out of the cocoon of awesomeness. Make a coffee, find a place to smoke a breakfast joint, and end this adventure. Hashtag Stealth Camping Alliance, Kush in the bush. Well, I guess first things first, let's get rid of camp. Let's put this cocoon of awesomeness back in the bag. Bam, just like that, caps cleaned up. Let's make a coffee. Coffee has been made. That is the sun right behind us. We got the road behind us. Let's smoke a joint. I know we'd smoke, said we'd smoke one of those uh, Cobra melts in the morning, uh, but for the first one, I want to smoke one of these lime lights, the sativas. Ah, then we don't burn out quite right away in the morning oh sleep was fantastic oh man so good wasn't cold at all so comfy got up at about 3 a.m. to use the bathroom crawled right back in and fell asleep and then yeah like I said I had the alarm set for 5 a.m. Uh, and it went off and I was like, uh-uh, nope. So, ended up sleeping for another hour. Fantastic. Things will get better. They always do, right? You just got to keep moving forward and keep saying good morning. Camping trips will probably only happen twice a month now. I'll do just a regular stealth camp and then I'll do the challenge for the month uh, hopefully we can do lives on each one so then we get that kind of like that four once a week type content <coughs> but we're gonna see how it goes uh, I got a camping trip booked in July yeah in July for the family so we'll go on an adventure then but yeah guys I'm gonna sit here and enjoy this joint um, I think we should rate it right now. Edison Cannabis Co. Uh, Limelight. 
MK Ultra times East Coast Sour Diesel, uh, 23% THC. Burns nice and clean. Tastes good. Um, yeah, there's definitely a little bit of sweetness to it, sourness to it. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to give it an 8. 8 out of 10. No complaints here. Um, nice and smooth on the throat and the lungs. And it being a sativa, I can't quite feel it yet. But let's just wait a little bit. And uh, maybe that'll start giving you that energy. But yeah, guys, uh, I think the next game plan will be to load the bag on the back and get back to the bike. Make sure it's still there. And then I'm not too sure. We haven't seen any trains this episode. So I might try to change that. It's going to be a beautiful day. Cushion the bush, hashtag Stealth Camping Alliance. And remember all the Alliance subgroups. Uh, we have the webpage, the Facebook group, and we now have a merch store. So go check that out. I can neither confirm or deny that there is something on the way. You'll have to wait and see, guys. Wait and see. Well, we're back here up at the fence line. There's the bike. You see it? There it is. Fantastic. Well, guys, I'm going to magically uh, get over this fence and we'll see you on the other side. Well, that wasn't too bad, actually. All uncovered. Uh, I'm going to put the tripod away, the phone away, and uh, let's go to a different location to smoke our second joint. And uh, hopefully we get some train action while we're there. I mean, it almost doesn't feel right not having some trains, right? So let's see if we can make that happen. Yeah, well, we're on this train bridge, right? I think I hear a train coming. So, when it does, you'll know. Well, I'm still on this bridge waiting for a train. It has not come. And I'm out of time. So, let's smoke one of these Edison joints. Uh, the Cobra milk. We have to rate the Cobra milk yet. Uh, this is the Indica. Cereal milk and jealousy is what it is grown with. Yeah, very creamy taste to it. Like a thick taste to it. It's really strange. I quite enjoy it. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching this episode of Cush in the Bush. It was uh, definitely very enjoyable to get out into the trees and sleep in the hammock and just chill with you guys for the night. It was really nice. Uh, these light fluffy clouds are blocking the sun right now. That's all right. Temperature was perfect last night. And honestly, the mosquitoes and stuff weren't too bad. I uh, ended up getting one mosquito bite on my hand, but uh, I think with age and stuff, you just, you don't get itchy anymore. It was itchy for like 30 seconds and then it was done. I can see it but it's not itchy, so. <coughs> That's cool. But yeah, guys, sorry there was no train. I tried. I've been kind of waiting here an hour now. And, you know, as soon as I hop on the bike, train will come. You know how that goes. 
Um, this stuff, it burns a little bit blocker than the other one. But again, it's still very smooth on the throat. The taste is its really good. It's, it's creamy. It's a thick, creamy taste. It definitely has like that dairy taste to it. I enjoy it. I quite like it. Uh, I'm going full nine on this. That's right, guys. Nine out of ten. Yeah, well, that's it. Uh, I'll say it one more time. Remember, hit that subscribe button, that like button, that notification bell, and uh, hit that like button right away. Definitely helps with the algorithm. Freaking English, right? But yeah, guys. We'll see you on the next adventure. Uh, the next adventure will be Dick in the Dirt's history challenge. I have yet, as of recording this, to have picked a location. But it's still like the second third of the month so we're okay we got some time and really any place i camp at i make history cushion the bush signing out hashtag stealth camping alliance and remember go check out the merch page josh from hidden hammock way to go brother way to go we'll see you in the next adventure guys smoke weed every day ciao for now